This tank has just hit the stalls. This is the American Tier 8 premium tank, the T-54E2, also known as the Shark, if you get the camo. They've changed it a little bit. This is a crate tank, but for gold, not cash. So, shall we see how stupid we all are? Hello again everybody and welcome back to Fujits Blitz. Now if you've logged into the game today you will see this pop-up, the T-54E2 Shark, an American Tier 8 premium tank, which is also a heavy. Now that's all the bump. I'm not going to go through all that. This video is called Caveat Emptor. Now Caveat Emptor in Latin is a legal phrase, it means buyer beware. Why? So why am I saying you've got to be lucky? Wow. The T-54E2 is in containers and you can get 21 for 20,000 gold, you can get 10 for 10,000 gold, you can get 3 for 2,500 or you can get 1 for 1,250. Now the thing is there are no charms. You're not guaranteed this tank no matter how much you drop and this is the thing. This is a tier 8 heavy tank with a 3% drop chance. Despite the fact it says each container includes the T-54, clearly it doesn't because you have a 3% drop chance. That is why I'm telling you, buyer beware. Okay, if you get the tank, you get 3 million credits if you already got it. But you haven't already got it because it's only just hit the stores. So, you know, if you get it a couple of times, you get 3 million credits. And you get compensation for the camo of 580,000 credits. But again, you haven't got the camo unless you get it a couple of times so that's why I'm saying buy and beware because 20,000 is about $50 in real money so guys be mindful of this this is more detail each container includes the T54E2 no it doesn't there is a 3% drop chance so there if you buy <laughs> I mean, each container doesn't contain the tank you have a 3% chance of getting the tank. If you get the tank, you get a garage slot. You may get the camo. You get boosters and all that sort of jazz. But guys, this is a tier eight. It's gonna cost you money. And it's a 3% drop chance. So, without further ado, let's wing across and let's see if I'm a lucky buggy today. Am I lucky? So this is my store and as you can see there's numerous types of containers that I can buy. Two containers again, extra one for 2,500. I can get 20,000 and get 21. I can spend 10,000 and get 10. Or I can get one for 1,250. So we bought the 16, the 20,000 one. There they are in the store. And that's all the stuff you can possibly get. So let's go for it. Da da da! Oh. Pusters. Hmm. That's okay, I've got 20 more to go. Fanfare. Pusters. And certificates. Not to worry, here we go again. Pusters and certificates. I've got to do this like 20 odd times, man. So 20,000 gold, roughly speaking, is about 50 odd dollars. But as you can see, at the moment, I'm just getting certificates and posters. Which is about as useful as a chocolate mouse in the desert. Let's not kid ourselves here. I'm hoping I'm going to get lucky. I mean, don't get me wrong, I'm getting a lot of free XP certificates. I'm getting a lot of posters and I'm getting a lot of stuff like that. Stuff that, you know, at the moment I don't really need. And I'll show you why I don't need it later. But... Voila, I'm still getting boosters, I'm still getting certificates. This has cost me $50 to do this so far. I mean, I just could have bought a bundle of boosters. But I'm hopeful. I am hopeful. Oh, I got the camo for a tank that I don't have. Hmm. Maybe that means I'm going to get the tank. Da, da, da. No, I'm not going to get the tank. I'm going to get certificates and boosters. What about now? <sighs> No, certificates and boosters. Maybe this time. Maybe I'm going to be looking now. 
Maybe not. So I'm you know, still trundling on. Let me add 21 of these bloody things to do. So trundling on. Uh, no, I didn't get anything. So at the moment, I haven't got a tank. Got some camo. I haven't got a tank. But I have some camo for a tank that I don't have. But I have camo. Camo is a good thing. Uh, no, still no tanky. I've got four crates left from my $50 expense. No. Mm, it's not looking good, is it? <gasps> I got a camo again! I've got two camos for a tank I don't have. Wow. Maybe now I'll get the tank. Get to the end of the crates. Um, maybe not. Last crate. Um, maybe not. So, I do this to show you what you're getting yourselves in for. So, I'm going to buy another crate for 2,500. That gives me quite a few crates, to be honest with you. It's not many. I mean, it's what, three, four? Oh, there we go, we get three crates. So, let's try our hand again. Da, da, da. Oh. I've got more camo! Yay! I've got three camos for a tank I haven't got. What about now? No tank. Last crate, here we go. Maybe, 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 maybe. No. So, I'm a bit of a twat. Um, I don't listen to buyer beware, so I'm going to buy another. 20,000 gold, yeah. drop it on another 21 crates. Don't forget guys, I do this crap so you are aware of what's going on. Maybe now, no, we're still getting certificates and boosters. I've now dropped 40,000, that's like a hundred and something dollars for a tier eight tank. I mean, I need my fucking head red. But I do this so you don't need to. So you understand what you're getting yourself into. I still haven't got the tank. <sighs> and you can tell the desperation now on me because I haven't got this tank. I've got plenty of posters. Yeah, the posters is nice. I like the posters. <sighs> I'm losing the will to live. I really am. I'm really losing the will to live. I'm scratching my head here thinking, really? Really? <gasps> I got the tank! It only cost me a hundred and something dollars! <laughs> yeah! Everything's turning up millhouse. Uh, back to the boosters. I don't care anymore. I got the tank. I've got 11 more to go. And guess what? I got the tank again! Are you fucking kidding me? Unbelievable! So my first 20,000, I've got jack squat apart from a load of camos. My second 20,000, I've got two tanks. My giddy aunt. I mean, it doesn't make it worth it. Oh my life. Back to the boosters, but now I don't care because I've got the tank. Twice. Oof. But, you know, I may get another camo. I don't know. I've got six crates left to go. And guess what happens? Boosters, yeah. But now it's just opening crates for the sheer hell of opening crates. You know, I've got the posters, I'll just keep trolling them. I've got another four crates to go, more posters. Yep, more posters and more certificates. It's okay, it's all good. I've got the tank, I've got it twice. Ah, uh, yeah, I've got more posters, more certificates. It's everything's good. Two crates left. Can we get more posters? No, we get another fucking tank. Three times. But it cost me a hundred and something. Why couldn't I get it drop in the first crate? Really? I mean, uh, exasperation and annoyance and everything kicks in. And look at all these fucking boosters I've now got. Unbelievable. I've got more boosters now than I need. I, I mean, look at, I mean, forget the XP. I've got 45 million credits. I don't need credit boosters. I've still got 47,000 gold. There's no tech tree tanks that I need to grind, so the 441 bloody thousand XP is no good for me. And look at all this. It's just, yeah, watch this, watch this. So I'm going to take those certificates, and look, I can combine them all. Now I can, I can do that. And I'm going to combine all of them up together. And now I've got, what, three certificates for 350,000 XP. Look at that, 350,000 XP. Oh my god. 
I mean, my will to live is exasperating downwards at this stage. But I've now got a new tank. It cost me a pretty penny. I'm a bit of a knob for doing it, but hey, I'm doing it so you don't. And there's the tank. And look, it comes with fuck all equipment. Seriously, Wargaming? Yeah, I mean, you could have given it equipment. But this is what the tank's all about. I mean, you can see the damage is not great. The rate of fire is not great. The penetration's average. The armor is average. The speed is average. I'm not going to play it. The reason I'm not going to play it is because generally I need to have a sit down after I've been financially raped. But, so I'm not going to play it. Not today. But I just want to show you all the crap that comes with it. I mean, this is not a tank that's going to be setting the world on fire. It's not OP. And, I mean, that's what it looks like. I mean, Christ. It looks like every other bloody American heavy tank. <sighs> <sighs> <laughs> the tears are trickling down my face you can't see it so now I've got to buy the equipment and look for the tier 1 equipment it's 190,000 credits Oof. I have to spend more money now so 190,000 times 3 now we go to the tier 2 that's 213,000 credits so I have to do that times 3 now the tier 3 that's 237,000 credits that times one because I'm not playing that. Then I got to load all the bloody ammo up, and yeah, it's 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 you know, my 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 will to live on this Friday afternoon is slowly but surely being sapped from me. My life force is dissipating. I mean, if you could see my eyes up close and personal, you would see them flickering as the life force slowly edges its way out of my body. Guys, I'm doing this for a reason, seriously. You may get lucky, you may not. It's cost me 40 odd thousand gold to get this tank. And that is a significant amount of money. I mean, 40,000 gold is in real terms, a hundred dollars, a hundred dollars. Okay, it's cheaper than the Super Conk, but there's no guarantee you're gonna get this tank. There's no charms. You will have to keep dropping gold until you get it. And what are you getting? I mean, what are you getting, really? You're getting a Tier 8 heavy tank. I mean, we all know that Tier 8 is the arse end of the universe for premium tanks anyway. I mean, there are more premium tanks than there are anything else. And for a fraction of the price, and I mean a fraction of the price, you can get a Louvre. You can get an IS-6, which has recently been buffed. Why on earth would you be so stupid, brain-dead, life, and idiotic enough to drop $100 on this POS? Well, I did. But I do it so you don't have to. I do this shit to educate you. So, the title of the video is Caveat Emptor, Buyer Beware. I'm not telling you how to spend your cash. I'm not telling you how to throw your cash around. I'm just telling you, this comes with a, a Fujit health warning. It will seriously damage your health. Be sensible. Have a flutter by all means, buy a couple of crates. Do not, for the love of God, do what I did. Why? Because you will not only resent yourself, you will resent wargaming and you will resent the tank and it will sit in your garage and it will collect dust. Anyway, that has been the grand crate opening of the T-54E2. It's currently in the stores. By all means, comment, like, fucking share the video, do whatever. Seriously, guys, be careful on this one. Anyway, I'd like to say a big thank you to all my subscribers, because without you, these videos would be meaningless. Big thank you to my Patreons, because without you, I wouldn't be able to do these videos um, as often as I do. And a big shout out to my only YouTube member, HyperSpider7. Until the next time, guys, I'm not going to ask you to send replays in. Please do not send me replays of you spending lots of cash on crates. Send me normal replays, not you sending crate replays. Until the next time, guys, realistically, keep your wallet shut, stay safe out there, have fun on the battlefield, and happy tanking. Because, you know, that is what it's all about having fun and being happy.